hello guys welcome to how to fix tech in this video guys we are going to fix this issue your pc could not turn off properly or did not start correctly the error code is 0 into c and then the 6 times 0 and then 1 so if you are getting the similar issue this video is for you you can press f8 key on your keyboard to start up setting here so let me press f8 key so I'm not able to press the F8 key on my keyboard. So I have to restart my system three to four times virtually so that I can get the screen off automatic or the advanced screen. And if you have the bootable pen drive, you can boot it from there and then go to next option and click on then repair your PC. So as you can see here, the guys, I have to boot from the USB so you have to do the same if you are not able to boot it from click on next then click on repair your computer now click on troubleshoot and click on command prompt and in the command prompt first of all we need to make sure that where the window has been installed it basically install in the C drive so press here C and then colon and type DIR to check the directory so in my case there is no windows profile data and users in it so let me press here the D and then colon and DIR now you can see guys program files I have users I have windows I have so it means that I am in the right directory so we need to hit the commands here the first command is bootrec space forward slash fix mbr and hit ok now the second command you need to type here bootsec space forward slash nt60 space sys this command and hit enter now if you see it is completed successfully now we need to hit the another command bootrec space forward slash fix boot this will repair the corrupted boot files command completed successfully now it's time to rebuild the bcd files here so we need to type our boot rec space slash rebuild bcd uh, this command will recreate the bcd i mean the boot files bcd files and you need to just wait here okay so guys the command is completed successfully now and you need to cross this out and click on continue with windows 10 so as you can see here the guys my issue has been fixed now and my system is booting and initially it will take some time i then i mean more than the usual time it will take So now you can see my system is booted now so this is how guys you can fix the issue so hope your issue is also fixed now if yes then hit like subscribe and share thank you thanks for watching how to fix tech